All right, so with only, with only like three days before Clutch Kickers, we've got some updates for you. Let's dive into some details. Ugh. As you can see, there's no motor in the car. The motor had a rough time getting to Golan Engines and now is at Golan Engines. So those who didn't see the last video, go watch it for one. For two, we hurt the Golan engine with an electrical problem that has not been fixed and uh, we're headed to Clutch Kickers round two, which is very important for us. So let's dive into some details. Okay, I'm gonna try to sum all this up into one sentence so when I edit this, I can chop it up a little easier. But here we go. So cat's out of the bag. I am renting the Clutch Kickers Corvette from Zach and Michael Castleberry. So super pumped that this was even available at the moment that I needed it. Um, and then aside from that, like nervous and hyped because I'm gonna finally get out of a 240 and drive a Corvette, which uh, is much more modern. So other than like seat adjustments and getting used to the chassis, uh, putting some BC shocks on the chassis and uh, yeah, just like looking forward to qualifying and racing at the Freedom Factory with only five races in the Clutch Kicker series. Uh, if I miss one, it will really hurt my points chase. So this is like very meaningful for me. Uh, our car is safe and sound at the Print House and Race Studio. No motor in it, of course. Golan's got the motor. Fixing the motor, sending it back to us. So looking forward to getting this thing back up and running to like fulfill the rest of the tour. But anyways, let's focus on the now. We're headed to Clutch Kickers. I'm gonna drive a Corvette. We'll see you guys there. And uh, yeah, wish me, wish me luck, man. Driveline, I run an Emerald Coast Performance and Machine Built 418 cubic inch 13 8 to 1 compression. It's based off an LS3. Uh, I've got a Holly High Ram on the car. It's fed with some nitrous outlet nitrous, 100 or 200 shot, depending on what track we're going to. The car has a built diff in it, but other than that, it's stock torque tube, stock trans. For my wheel and tire package, I run a Conse Astro 18 by 9.5 up front, 18 by 10.5 out back, and I run a 265 3518 Accelera 651 Sport up front and a 285 3518 Accelera 651 Sport extra out back. 